Alrighty, this video is just going to show you quickly how to restore your computer. So the reason you want to restore your computer is if, say you tried updating it and something didn't update properly and now you're getting errors, or you have a you downloaded something you shouldn't have, now you have a virus, or just any, there's a, there's a lot of reasons why you might want to restore your computer, but I believe those are the two main ones. So on Windows 7, what you're going to want to do is go down to your start menu and search programs and file, type in restore, and you'll see system restore. Backup and restore is something completely different. Don't click that. Hit system restore. It'll open. You'll see this. Know that this process can be reversed, but if you're going to restore your computer, it's probably for a good reason. So you're going to hit next. Now, you can see that there's two save points here. One's for yesterday, or sorry, two days ago, and one's for New Year's Day. It's when I did an update. I can also click show more restore points. The reason I'd click show more restore points is say I installed something three days ago and it only shows me two restore points from for yesterday and today. What I would want to do is go before that three day mark where I installed something I shouldn't have. And you can see 12, 23, I would hit next and I would hit finish. I'm not actually going to do that just because I don't want to restore my computer. I've done a ton of updates today and I don't want to lose those. But that's how you restore your computer. Your computer is going to go through a process where you won't be able to use it when you do that. That's fine. It's going to restart your computer when it's done. You just log in and everything should work as it was from the day that you did the restore. So any virus or any programs that you filled out will be gone. Just remember that if you put any pictures or any documents or you did work on your computer, all of that will be gone. So you want to put any of that kind of stuff onto a USB drive before you do the restore. If you, if you don't want to lose it, put it on a USB like, comment, subscribe. I hope this helped. If it didn't or you have any questions, comment. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks, everybody.